going down, Molly Skylar friends. Welcome back. I am at the uh, old uh, Skylar compound today. I have a little find from uh, Sam's Club, my new best friend, and I, they have these tacos. Now, I've never seen. I mean, I've seen them in the freezer. These actually weren't freezer tacos. They were uh, in the, I guess, deli-ish section. Um, white meat, chicken, cheese, roasted corn salsa in a crispy corn tortilla. Now, I opened one just to take a look. These are not crispy tortillas. <laughs> They're slightly dry. Um, let's see. Oh, hold on. <laughs> That's my taco. I, I, you know, let's open a second one just because. So I'm not. Maybe I got a bad one. Okay, that one has some stuff in it. I, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe yeah, your guess is about as good as mine. Anyway, so I've got these two packages and 56 tacos. Perfect. So I've got 112 tacos. Um, according to the back with the calories, 150 calories per serving, 14 servings per package, so about 8,400 calories, I think, if I'm correct. Um, something like that. Anyway, uh, it says they're microwavable. I think I'm probably gonna go there because I, I, I feel that if I were to put these in the oven, instead of, uh, just so you can see the mic, it's a microwave one. <laughs> oh my gosh. If I put them in the oven, I have a feeling I'm going to be into a catastrophic situation where I'm going to shred my mouth. And because they already seem extremely dry. There's only about five pounds here, but for the bulk of it, it's actually a decent amount of food for five pounds. I and mean, if you can see this, this is probably a good quart container for so about a, almost a gallon's worth of tacos. It's a decent amount, but it is five pounds. It's mostly dry shell. So this is not really gonna be an easy challenge for a five pound challenge. It's gonna be dry. I have a feeling I might, I don't know, I might get something to dip it in, maybe some ranch or something like that. I have a huge gallon of ranch in my fridge. Thanks to my boss, appreciate you. Happy birthday, Rick. Anyway, I'm gonna throw these in the microwave. <laughs> And I'll be back with you in a little bit because I'm not really quite sure how long I'm how long it's gonna take. Maybe five, ten minutes total to microwave these up. Um, and the only reason I'm going to microwave them because it might steam them and make them a little softer. So, Molly Skyler, mom and woman versus food versus 112 dry expletive tacos. Let's do this. So I microwaved up these bad boys. Oh my gosh. So that, I can actually feel the heat coming off this one still. Probably, I probably wasn't for microwaving. I, I microwaved them in the actual pouch. Cause I, like I said, I did actually try to steam these up a little bit. Cause they were, you haven't heard me say it in a while. Drier than a popcorn fart. Yeah, I haven't said it for a while. So. But see, like, there is quite a bit of food in here. This is half. Um, five pounds, this is a lot of food. Like I said, it's, it's mostly dry weight. It's a lot of 112 tacos. Only five pounds of food. It's like, oh, oh gosh. There you go. So, actually, I didn't think we can get this. I will definitely be using ranch with this. So I've got a gallon of my Lito's ranch from Lito's Pizza. Check this out. It was 112 tacos on my tray. <laughs> I really didn't actually think so. Now, man, I know I, when I bought it, it looked kind of like, okay, but once you actually take it out of the package, you kind of just kind of like, hmm. So, I am a cottage cheese girl instead of a sour cream girl, but I don't have enough in my fridge, so I am actually gonna use this ranch. Um, don't know how long it's gonna take, don't know if I'm gonna use all the ranch. 
not optimistic about this one. They now after I've microwaved them, they're they're actually a lot softer. Like if you can see inside these tacos, there's not a whole heck of a lot. It's mostly going to be the dry shell. Um, um, they're a little bit softer now, but so I am going to honestly use the ranch to my benefit on this one. But like I said, if you get see here, I've got 112 tacos. Um, <laughs> I don't know. This is not one of my brighter ideas, but you know what? They actually looked okay until I got them out of the package, and now I'm kind of like, well, you know, so. Let's do this for the sake of Taco Day. It's December. There's a Christmas tree, and I've got cats in the back. I'm, so. Ugh. I'm not going to go all ham on this because I. Mm. <laughs> Three, two, one. 112 tacos. Oh god. That's dry. Wow. Wow. Looks so I'm still trying to taste where the corn salsa is at because I'm not tasting it. <laughs> Definitely drying out my mouth. They're not easy to swallow. Honestly, the ranch doesn't make them any better. They're just pretty awful. <laughs> oh my God.
21. Oof, the Nelly. <clears throat> that honestly, oof. Not the hardest challenge in the world, but definitely consistency wise in the way that the, these tacos are. Like I said, the taste wise, I would say not good at all. Uh, you definitely need to soup it up with some kind of salsa or something. I didn't really get much more than a. Uh, a chicken goo-ish in the middle. It wasn't really, you couldn't tell what was in there. <laughs> not gonna lie. Um, overall, I mean, five minutes and 21 seconds, not awful. Uh, totally could have done it e easily under five. I probably could have done it under four if I would have been standing up and you know, trying to go at it, I suppose. Um, I remember Gringo Bandito. I'm gonna say they're about the same size, but the thing is they had a lot more debris. So those tacos, I wanna say, and they were floppier, they kind of fell apart. They had like 160 of them in 10 minutes. So, I mean, given the pace, I could probably do a little bit better. But, 112 tacos. Ugh. That is a whole sheet tray full of tacos gone in about five minutes. Like and subscribe. If you want to see anything else or sponsor something, let me know. And we'll get back at you with a couple more of these uh, home challenges because now it's cold out and I really don't want to travel anymore. So, We'll catch you later.